Welcome to the second in a series of instructional videos explaining how to install the SolarEdge Home Low Voltage Battery successfully. In this video, we'll guide you through how to safely wire the battery modules between them and the inverter. And as you'll soon find out, it's a simple, straightforward process. Let's quickly review which tools are needed to complete the battery wiring. In the battery to battery kit, you will find two DC cables, a communication cable, and a grounding cable. Please note additional cables and accessories should be ordered separately from SolarEdge, according to the amount of batteries you'd wish to install. First, open all of the left covers using the three screws. Before connecting any cable, make sure the circuit breakers are off in all the batteries. Then, pull the different plug-ins that are sealing the DC connectors and communication connections. Now let's start connecting the cables between the batteries in the first tower. The first cable will be the communication cable on the two batteries tower. Assemble it between the bottom communication connector of the upper battery to the upper communication connector of the bottom battery and secure the cable once it's connected. Make sure the communication cable is secured along its length and tighten it first by hand without using tools. If it doesn't screw easily, please unscrew it and try again. Now, assemble the red cable between the bottom red DC connector of the upper battery to the upper red DC connector of the bottom battery. You will need to hear a click sound once it's properly connected. Afterward, assemble the black cable between the bottom black DC connector of the upper battery to the upper black DC connector of the bottom battery. Once again, you'll need to hear a click sound once it's properly connected. Last but not least, the grounding cable. Connect it from the left screw of the upper battery to the right screw of the battery below it. In case your system contains more than two batteries, continue wiring them as demonstrated similarly. After connecting the batteries, we will move forward with the installation by connecting both towers. The tower-to-tower -tower kit contains two DC cables, a communication cable, and a grounding cable. Please notice that the cable length fits a 30 to 40 centimeter distance from tower to tower. In case the distance is longer or shorter, you will need to crimp a new cable to the desired length. Please refer to the SolarEdge user manual for supported cables and pin assignment. Now, connect the cables between the bottom batteries in each tower. First, connect the communication and ground cables between the towers. Please pay attention that the cables shouldn't be lying on the ground. Wire the cable above the battery left cover and only then connect them to the right connector. Then, connect the DC red and black cables between the towers. Choose a bottom connector with a matching color in each battery. Similarly, first wire the cable above the left cover, avoiding laying it on the ground. With all four cables between towers connected, we can continue and connect the batteries to the inverter using the inverter to battery kit included in the battery pack. The inverter to battery kit contains two DC cables, communication cable, and a grounding cable. All cables' lengths are 2.5 meters, which should be enough in most installations. Yet, if the length is insufficient, you will need to crimp your own cables and use connectors from the connector's accessory kit, which can be bought separately. Before connecting to the inverter, make sure it is off. Connect the communication cable to the top battery's connector marked with INV. Then, connect the communication cable to the inverter. Thereafter, make sure to connect the grounding cable to the utility ground. Lastly, connect the red and black DC cables from the top battery in the tower to the inverter. Pay attention to the polarity at the inverter side. Now, after you've finished wiring, turn on the circuit breakers and close the tower covers and the left covers in all batteries. Well done! You've now successfully wired the SolarEdge Home Low Voltage Battery. Please continue to the SolarEdge Home Low Voltage Battery commissioning video.